As a journalist, you know that getting the most accurate and up-to-date information is essential to your work. In today's digital age, web scraping can be an individual tool for gathering information quickly and efficiently. We are Parsub, and today, we'll discuss how journalists can use web scraping to improve their content. We'll cover everything from data collection to article writing. We'll also provide tips and tricks for getting the most out of your web scraping endeavors. So let's get started and show you how you can use web scraping to take your journalism career to the next level. Here are four ways journalists can use web scraping to improve their content. Scrape data sets, scrape press release websites, scrape news websites, scrape websites to create your own data. Now let's go more into detail. Scrape data sets. As a journalist, you know that reliable data is essential to your work. Unfortunately, collecting data can be time consuming and expensive. Web scraping can help you collect the data you need quickly and efficiently. There are a number of ways you can use web scraping to collect data sets. One way is to scrape government websites. These websites often have large data sets that can be difficult to sort through manually. Another way to collect data sets is to scrape research papers from academic journals. This can be especially useful if you're working on a story that requires data from a specific field or discipline. Scrape press release websites. Press releases are a great source of information for journalists. They can provide you with background information on a story, quotes from experts, and contact information for sources. Unfortunately, sorting through press releases can be time consuming. Fortunately, web scraping can help automate this process. There are a number of ways you can use web scraping to scrape press release websites. One way is to set up a scraper that collects all the press release from a website and saves them in a database. Another way to use web scraping for press release is to set up a scraper that collects press release based on the specific keywords. This can be helpful if you're looking for press releases on a particular topic. Scrape news websites. News websites are a great source of information for journalists. They can provide you with breaking news stories, background information, and quotes from experts. Like press release websites, sorting through news websites can be time consuming. Web scraping can help you automate this process. There are a number of ways you can use web scraping to scrape news websites. One way is to use a scraper that collects all the headlines from a website and saves them. Another way to use web scraping for news website is to set up a scraper that collects news stories based on a specific keyword. Scrape websites to create your own data. In some cases, the data you need may not be readily available online. In these cases, you may need to create your own data. One way to do this is scrape websites. This can help you gather the right type of data in just a few minutes. It can be very helpful in cases where you need specific data that is not readily available. There are a number of ways you can use web scraping to create your own data. One way is to scrape product websites. This can be helpful if you're working on a story that requires data from a specific industry. Another way to use web scraping to create your own data set is to scrape social media websites. This can be helpful if you're looking for data on a particular topic or demographic. These are just a few ways journalists can use web scraping to improve their content. Web scraping is a powerful tool that can save you time and help you create better content. So what are you waiting for? Thanks for watching our video. If you want to learn more about web scraping, check us out at parsop.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos on web scraping, data, and the internet. Happy scraping!